Help support Mr. King Lim by checking out Patreon.com. What's up everyone, this is Mr. King Lim here. And today you join me for an opening which I've been very hyped about. It's possibly the most hyped I've been for a very long time for a set. It is the Legendary Duelist Ancient Millennium Box. Why? Because this set has a lot of good support for some of my favourite art types. First off, introduces new support for Ancient Gears. Uh, Actually, the Ancient Gear Fusion, at the time of filming this video, is the most expensive Ultra in this set, so that's definitely got some good hype. You've got new support for Crystal Beasts, uh, really good support actually. Uh, and of course, you've got probably the main reason they bought this set, the Relinquished support. Now, for anyone that doesn't know Relinquished, of course, who's up there, uh, is one of my favourite monsters of all time. Uh, I remember getting the Star Deck Pegasus as a child, and yeah, it was definitely my card for a long time. Uh, but yeah, the fact that they brought out support for Relinquished and Millennium Eyes is definitely a very exciting prospect. Oh, and just for the record, um, just before I open this video, um, there are two things. One, I've actually bought a second one of these boxes. Um, it isn't here just yet, because I actually ordered it before all the hype before like I knew what was in the set so that box should be probably uploaded in a couple of days time also uh, if you want to help support uh, Mr. King Liam to make sure we can have uh, more booster boxes more regularly then uh, check out my Patreon uh, at patreon.com I believe forward slash Mr. King Liam if you want to help support the channel and so that we can get uh, more, more booster boxes more regularly because it's Definitely something that I do want to do. Put some more booster boxes. So, uh, doors pack. So we have 36 packs, five cards. 36 packs, five cards in each. So let's get started. And first off, we have one of the good reprints in this set: Worm Bait, Black Illusion Ritual, Instafusion. Uh, then we have Y. Uh, YWXYZ Dragon Cannon and Ojama uh, Macellation. Oh, yeah, the new, Ajo new support for Ojamas, Band of Keep cards, and, and Weevil cards are in here. And there's also uh, some two really good reprints as rares as well Insect Queen, uh, Crystal Beast Ruby Carbuncle, on Dragon Level 5. Oh, uh, we have Illusionless Faceless uh, Magician. Actually, need one of those. And we have. Oh, we have our first Ultra Rare. This is. Desperado Barrel Dragon. So this is one of the new Band and Keith cards. Um, this is actually a pretty good card for uh, the Machine Arts type. Uh, also the artwork is uh, pretty good as well. So um, I have to say, all the Ultras in this set are actually pretty good. Obviously the ones I prefer to get is the Relinquished and Crystal Beast ones, but I wouldn't mind getting the, the Ancient Gear Fusion as well. Arm Dragon Level 7, Panzer Dragon, uh, that's a nice reprint. For those uh, instant fusion targets, Ancient Gear Golem Ultimate Pound, uh, BM4 Blast Spider, and we have Ultimate Crystal Magic. So, this is another one of the Crystal Beast cards. So this helps you get out your Rainbow Dragons, and I believe the Fusion as well. Oh, yeah, that's another card I'd like the uh, Rainbow Dragon Fusion. Definitely would like that. It's interesting they printed that as a super, as a super rather than an ultra, I have to say. Oja Magic, a Vortex Trooper, Crystal Tree, Instant Fusion, and we have another Illusionless Faceless Magician. I think I needed two of those, so that's good, so we've already got those. I'm drawing in level 5. Oh, an Ultimate Ancient Gear Golem. Uh, definitely happy to see this reprint. Um, I don't think it was the easiest card to get. Um, I'm not sure if it's been reprinted before. Also, a per perfectly ultimate great morph. I don't actually have this card, so that's nice. I'm Dragon Level 3, and we have Corrosive Scales. Speaking of ultimate great morph, that's a scene from the original anime. Where it's uh, corroding Gaia, the dragon champion. I do like I do like the fact that they're like using some of the anime scenes for all their artworks now. Barrel Dragon, a Thousand Eyes Restrict, I'm Dragon Level 7. Crystal release and, and a playset of Illusionist Faceless Magician already. Oh, blimey. Oh, we've suddenly got all of those we needed now. Crystal Tree, 
Blossphere, Thousand Eyes District, Battle Dragon, and we have a German Macellation. So far, we seem to be pulling quite a few of the same rares. Crystal Release, Instant Fusion, I think that's our second one. Ancient Gear Golem, Ojama Pajama, I really like that name, I have to say. And we have. Oh, uh, Ancient Gear uh, Megaton Golem. So, this is the new Ancient Gear Fusion. Uh, I believe this is a really powerful card, I believe. Yeah, it works, works really well with the Ancient Gears. Um, I'm still, still not 100% sure if I'll build Ancient Gear Fusions. The Ancient Gear deck profile I'd made was like Link and Exceeds. So I'm not sure if I'll build uh, Rituals. Uh, M, say B, M4 Blast Planet. For some reason I have a hard time saying that. But yeah, it's uh, nice to see the Ancient Gears are getting some really good support. Uh, I've got to start going through the comments now. Oh, we have uh, a loose illustration magician. This is our fourth one, and we have oh, okay, another desperado battle dragon. Uh, okay, that's all right, I suppose. Not the ultra I wanted to get two of, that's for sure. But hopefully, um, hopefully now we can start get some of the cards. Um, I actually looked at a couple of videos of this set, and the majority of them had usually had three of the ultras I was looking for. Panzer Dragon, Barrel Dragon, Ultimate Ancient Gear Golem, Ultra Magic, and Ojama Pajama. <laughs> I like that name. So, I did see one box which had two Desperado Barrel Dragons. I believe it had, I believe it had Rainbow Dr I believe it had the Crystal Beast support. That's Relinquished. Plus Sphere, Wormbait, Ojama Mesolation, and we have... Oh, uh, Arm Dragon Catapult Cannon. Oh, that's nice. Um, so yeah, this isn't this is a powerful card, but it's one of the uh, definitely very difficult one to get out. But uh, I quite like that. It's a collector's card. So far, we've got three supers. Um, the average seems to be five ultras and three. So five ultras and twelve supers. Rainbow Dragon. That seems to be the uh, the usual. Oh, Ancient Gear Frame. First one of those. So hopefully in the supers I can pick up that Rainbow Dragon Fusion. Ultimate Bound, Relinquished, Ultimate Ancient Gear Golem. And we have a Joma match. So a Joma match. Haven't had that one yet. Black Illusion Ritual again. Wembait, another one of them. Uh, Corrosive Scales. And we have a Cross Dimensional Duel. Now uh, this is another Ancient Gear card. It's uh, and like I said earlier, with uh, oh, it's quite appropriate actually. Corrosive scales. Like I said earlier, they're uh, revisiting some of the anime battles. This is the first episode of Yu-Gi-Oh GX, where Crowler and his ancient gears face faces off against Jaden and his elemental heroes. We have oh, Parasite Paranoid, first one of those. So now that we're getting to the end of the right side. Seems to be getting a bit more variety with the rares at the moment. Sapphire Pegasus. Illusionless Faceless Edition. Jeez, this is my fifth one now. And we have... Oh, there we go. There's one of the cards I needed. Millennium Eyes Restrict. So, yeah, this is a, a very cool new fusion for the uh, Relinquished Archetype. Uh, really good artwork as well. And, uh, yes, I uh, definitely needed one of those. Uh... I think for the deck profile I need two, I believe. I need at least two of those, three of Illusionist and three of the Fusion. So I'm happy that we've got one. A one bait, I believe that's the place set. Time Machine, Relinquished, Crystal Released, and Ojama Match is our rare. So now it's time for the other side of the box. Uh, you may notice a slight cut in the video there, because I thought someone was at the was at the door. So just watch the door. Okay, now for the second half. Pincher Hopper, Arm Dragon Level Five, Insect Queen, Sapphire Pegasus, and uh, Ojama Pajama. I will say that's probably the only. Well, that's maybe the main criticism I have about this set is why weren't the Ojamas reprinted? That one made a lot of sense. I'm just saying. Because the Ajamas aren't the easiest cards to get. Crystal Release, Ancient Gear Golem, Limiter Removal, 
of Jama Pajama, and we have Rainbow Bridge. That's another one of the cards I need. And I have to say, this is probably one of the best artworks in this set as well. Uh, I know my camera can't really pick it up, but uh, because of the light, yeah, sorry. But yeah, that is a very nice design. So yes, uh, got two of the ultras I needed. The Rainbow Dragons, the, I keep saying Rainbow Dragon, it's Crystal Breeze. The Crystal Breeze support isn't the most expensive, but it's just nice to get out, I think. Then we have Corrosive Scales. Mind you, I still haven't got those rare reprints yet. Now, I did. I have actually looked at a video, a couple, well, a couple of videos. Uh, a couple of boxes didn't have any of them, which is a little bit of a shame. Uh, then we have Parasite Paranoid. Yeah, so Konami definitely made those short prints. That's, mm, that's definitely the main criticism I have about the box. Rams of Dragon. Ancient Gear Frame, we have something. Oh, there it is, uh, Rainbow Over Dragon. So we actually got the, we got the fusion for Rainbow Dragons. Actually, I'm just going to take a quick look, because that's, um, I mentioned artwork. That is definitely a very good piece of artwork. Um, now, the interesting thing is, the OCG actually got this ultra rare. We got it as a super. So that means um, we actually had a rarity downgrade for this. Now, I know, obviously, it's easier to get, but I think, I think this card probably was deserving of an ultra, I have to admit. Maybe move one of the Will and Crystal Crystal Beast cards down to a super. So it's easier to get. So like move illusionist to a super. I want to make it a lot easier to get. Just saying. We have Blast Fit, Ojama Masolation again. Still none of those reprints. Ooh. Oh sorry, I thought I didn't take all the cards then. Crystal Tree, Relinquished, Time Machine, Ultimate Pound, and Crystal Scales again. Jeez, getting a lot of them. So I believe we have one Ultra left, and if we're lucky, maybe maybe a second. We'll find out. Vortex Trooper, Thousand Eyes Restrict, Ultimate Ancient Gear Golem, Level 7, Atom of Isolation again. Packs are definitely causing a problem. I'll have a one bite. A drama, a drama match, and we. Oh, sorry, no, that was the rare. Whoops. I thought we had another card. So, we, how many supers we got? We got five supers, so I believe we're missing at least one. Go away, packs. It's only downside when you have a lot of stuff. Go away. <laughs> sorry. A drama level. And now I'm saying Ajamas. I'm dragging level 5. Another Illusionist Faceless Mage. That's at least two playsets. Jeez, this card really likes me. And we have... Oh, another Ancient Gear Megaton Golem. I'll take that. Good good support for the Ancient Gears. Don't mind pulling two of those. That's a nice restrict. Ajama Masolation again. And... Ah, Relinquish Fusion. That's another one of the Ultra Rares I needed. So, it looks like the trend continues with these boxes. Uh, because earlier, of course, I said uh, that usually I get... Usually the, the box gets... The box has three of the Ultras I needed. Which is good. So, I've got one Rainbow Bridge, one Relinquish Fusion, and one Millennium Eyes Restrict. Now, if we're lucky, we might get a six Ultra... Um, I believe I did do that in my last box. I can't remember. Instant Fusion. It's in the wild. Uh, Parasite Paranoid. Getting a little bit paranoid that we haven't pulled that rare. <laughs> Mind you, I'm not surprised because some people didn't get any in their box. But some people, one person actually got a playset. This is crazy. Insect Queen. Rainbow Dragon. Limited Removal. A Jama Pajama. God, I could definitely, definitely going to have a lot of those. <laughs> Time Machine, Black Illusion Ritual, Instant Fusion, Ajama Match, and we have... Oh, Heavy Metal Raiders! Now, oh, this is a, a card we haven't done yet. So this is another Bandit Keith card. Uh, I find it funny because it make, makes a reference to the Metal Raiders set. So it has a, a lot of Bandit Keith's old cards. It has Lords of... Hang on, I'll just put the cards down. It has Lords of Spider, Zorok, Slot Machine, 
uh, Pendulum Machine, Blast Sphere, Barrel Dragon, and the... I'm not sure what that one is there. But yeah, that's uh, actually a really nice piece of artwork. So how many packs have we got left? We've got... Four packs left. We now have our seven supers. Can we uh, can we get lucky with a six ultra perhaps? Or one of those rares. Insect Queen. Pajama Pajama again. Pajama seems to like me. Like I said, I could have built them a Jamba deck, but they didn't reprint the Ajamas. Three packs left, including this one. Edge of Magic, Vortex Trooper, Crystal Tree, Instant Fusion, Parasite Paranoid. <laughs> Two packs left. Uh, B4M Blast Spider. So BM4. So last pack. Well, we're not going to get both of the reprints. By the way, just for anyone that doesn't know, the reprints is actually Mimikat and Toon Kingdom. Uh, those are two. Those are two cards I need to. If I want to build a competitive tomb deck, put me I find a bit easily. So Barrel Dragon, Fells and Isis Strict, I'm Dragon Level 7, Crystal Release, and Parasite Paranoid. Ah, uh, Konami, you don't make pulling those rares easy, do you? One whole box, face six packs, none of those rares. Damn it. <laughs> well, I knew I knew it was hard to get. In fairness, this is actually. This is actually quite surprising because this is actually the first box that I've seen on YouTube which doesn't have either of them in the same box. So the, they usually get at least one of one of them but this one had none. So yeah, that's going to be a very expensive rare. So a quick flick for the rares. Obviously we've got a lot of pajamas. We actually pulled two playsets of Illusionist Faceless Magician which is crazy. Uh, I'm not sure how many ancient gear frames we pulled. Uh, let me just double check. Sorry, just counting on the fly. Alright, we pulled one, two. Oh, we only got two of ancient gear frame. So it's not a complete blade set either. <laughs> so, yes, the uh, int intriguing rares. Uh, so anyway, but uh, the hollows I'm definitely a lot happier with. So we have heavy, heavy metal raiders. We had got two uh, ancient gear mega sun golems. We got one rainbow over dragon, a cross dimensional door, arm dragon cabal cannon, and a ultimate crystal magic. And for our ultras, we got two of the Desperado Battle Dragon. Uh, we got one Rainbow Bridge, one Relinquished Fusion, and one Thousand Nights Restrict. So, at least the Hollows are definitely, uh, I'd say the Hollows were probably a better ratio than the Rares. So, uh, yeah, not a bad box, I'd say. I got some of the stuff I needed, and uh, some of the collector cards, I guess. Um, like I said at the start of the video, uh, I do have another Legend of Doors Ancient Millennium box on the way. Uh, it, it isn't here at the time of filming this, so it'll probably be up in a few days' time. But uh, yeah, hopefully we'll get some of the some more of the cards we need. Especially those Toon Rares. Because I really want those Toon Rares. I've been thinking about building a Toon, back, toon deck for a long time, but those are the two cards which always made it a bit uh, unlikely because they were so expensive. So anyway, there was an opening of a ancient. There was an opening of a legendary Dollars ancient millennium box. Um, if you enjoyed this video, then please make sure to like this video, subscribe to the channel to check out to uh, see when my newest openings were coming up, including the next ancient millennium box. Also, be free to check out my previous openings. And if you want to help support Mr. King Liam, then please check out my Patreon at uh, patreoncom Liam. The link will be in the description below and in the annotations at the end of the video. I hope you've enjoyed this video and for now this is Mr King Liam signing out.